Hello, everybody. I'm back. Um, a little bit, uh, you know, seasonal. And that cough that I've been having forever kind of finally kicked me. And so I'm, I'm feeling like I'm rebounding. So I hope you're all staying safe out there and healthy. But I'm Janelle Sherman, and I want to welcome you in. Um, Tanya's here with us today, who's amazing. She takes all the beautiful photos on her website at sara.com. Michelle, who you know, she's my buddy and um, just does everything. I couldn't do what I do without her. And Mickey, of course, I love it. You're already telling Mickey, unpin the bar, Mickey. So he just, <laughs> yeah, don't we just love him? He's like, yep, got it, got it. So anyway, ladies, thank you so much because we love being interactive with you and we want to hear from you. So um, we are going to start the show out. I, I'm kind of excited. Um, the way that I did the trays, I kind of pared down what a possible one look could be. So I got a purple look, I got a pink, soft pink, a brighter kind of Amazonite, and then a, a more of a turquoise color, um, a green and red, which you ladies got to have a sneak peek of the red coral yesterday that Michelle peeky booed. Mm -hmm. uh, sneaky peek, right? That's what they always say in Australia. I just love that, that sneaky peek. Mm -hmm. And um, then of course, a really beautiful greens with praiseolite, mixing some labradorite into it. And then of course, my favorites, the neutral trends. So your gray moonstone, your black spinels, your white quartzes. So um, I've got a ton, I, just about something for everybody today. Amberly's but loving what are we pop. doing? Oh, thank you, Emily. Thank Nikki you, thank you. Nikki right likes it because it looks like leathery, like it looks like it's maybe wet leather or something. But thank you so much. <laughs> it's nice and cool for the, yeah, because mm -hmm. it's definitely heated up and they canceled on me this week with my air conditioner again. So oh. I'm waiting another week, oh. ladies, right? The struggle is real. I know. That's why my collection is named that. It'll be fall soon and cold. <laughs> I know, right? My heating bill should be great this year, right. right? Yeah, my electric bill. There's always a positive, right? At the end of the rainbow, there's always gratitude. Is. I actually yes. have air conditioning that could break. Mm. That's true. Right? So, what do we have tonight? We have, of course, you can view us on YouTube. We're on uh -huh. Facebook, but also over on YouTube. YouTube. Yes, that so. like, we have directions how to do that for the. I've had to be really tech savvy this week, organizing all my copyrights and putting them in things. Uh, so I am really needing instructions if it's anything <laughs> else that's techy. So yeah, I always try to drop the link in the Facebook feed so they can click it on and go straight over to the to the live stream. So. Thank yeah. you, Mickey. Oh, so thank you, Mickey. Yes, yeah. make it easy for the ladies. And, and we have, um B10 is the 10% okay. off all beaded jewelry with a $100 minimum purchase. That ends Thursday. So a couple okay. more days for that. Okay. We have a new beginning spend and save this week. So if you spend money on buying the new new beginning, new new beginning, yes. then you can save some money there. <gasps> so we have that I going love on. love some of those. Oh my gosh, the employee shopping was yes. crazy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that's fun. all they picked was new beginnings. <laughs> oh I know, God. we did. And tomorrow, uh, make sure to hop on Facebook. We um, post our like, mm -hmm. share, and tag tomorrow. Invite a friend. And so by sharing that, then we'll be doing the There's spinner There's always free goodies Friday. that we yeah. give out with the spinner, which is always so fun. And that'll be on Friday. Okay, cool. And that's we a fun have stuff, new right? designs. We have... Uh, we well, do. Like, always. We always. Today. <laughs> oh, and on the website, we have a new drop down that says new design. So if you are just trying to... Customers were requesting, oh. wanting to, oh, I just want to see what's just new. Just the new stuff. So I started tagging those. So then there's a drop down under the socials. On the feature. Sorry, under the feature. Oh, under the feature. Yeah. Okay. It says new designs, and yeah. then you can see the new collection. Yeah, so as anything's new, then yes. you just put it yep. in there. So, well, that should be like our coffee for, shop area. It'll too. live there for a week. Just so a week. As and then, I take them down, yep. or as I take them off the social page, I'll take them off there as well. Yeah. Is a week enough, ladies? Yeah, we may do it longer. Just, uh, yeah. we'll see. Yeah. It's when just we, a way to manage. I mean, yeah. sometimes with the Jodo pricing, I... Sometimes they don't last a week. Yeah, right? yeah, that's also yeah. True. I think that's true. <laughs> so um, that is it. And then, oh, don't forget uh, adding jewelry cleaners, the sizer bundles, and those brand ambassador cards at okay. checkout. Okay. And I started with kind of a neutral palette because I cannot wait to get started. But we've got some new debuts that I cannot wait. I, some other silver bracelets and some things that um, mm -hmm. I felt like we needed for our stacking layers. So, um, yeah, I think I'm going to get started because I'm going to show you everything. Then I'm going to put it on and kind of preview so you can kind of get a look of what it might look like from afar. Okay. 
All right, here we go, ladies. So, of course, one of my favorite pieces, I know, you know I'm gonna go straight for my favorite ring because I just, like, love a good statement ring, but also a really great fitting statement ring. And I just love the Kingman Turquoise um, and these really beautiful, like, there's almost like this bluish shade to the purple, which I think makes it so wearable, right? And such a huge piece like this. Um, I just, it, it's literally one of my favorite styles because look at I did the inside. Like, this is just gonna be that huggy snug fit that I just, oh! It's, I, I just always imagine giving you ladies a big kiss when you wear these pieces. Um, I also snuck on, I'll be showing that on a different tray, but um, my diamond ring. So this is the one that I have the most diamonds in. And I paired it back to the last tray that I'm going to show you because I stacked another ring where you could double this up and it was so pretty with the little bling bling um, with the Black Knight. So I can't wait to show you that later. Um, okay, so let's get into the purple turquoise, uh, the Kingman turquoise, because of course I'm always going to do coordinating pieces. And this is one where we just got a little bit more stock in. So hopefully we do have your sizes and um, if it's meant to be, it's meant to be. Um, because we just got a, a, just a small little refill on this one. And this one I love because it's really going to work for so many people because of the adjustability that you have on it. And really easy access because I always do my really beautiful lobsters, but they make it so easy to put on because of the swivel feature. So getting your little fingers in there. See, because my little nail, this is my little nail I work with. I match stones, I do everything. I can't get this nail to grow, so like I gotta have an easy access. You know, I have to have a clasp that works really well for me. And Ooh, here brace, we go. Bracelet's gonna fit a six to eight inch wrist. Okay, so I'm a six inch wrist, so I'm gonna stick it right on me. Actually, that probably even could be five and a quarter because, yeah. Um, yeah, so ladies that are five and a quarter, that could work for you too, but we always uh, shy on the safe side for you just to make sure. Oh, look how pretty. Oh, this is our This Show Only bracelet, mm -hmm. too. We brought this in at an amazing price, uh, a size for almost everybody. So I'll, I'll tour that a little bit later, too. But let's go into the matching coordinating pendant. So Sally was asking if that turquoise is natural in color. Oh, no. The purple turquoise is at the Kingman dyed. So you see the blue that comes out of it? That is the, the different shades of blue that they've they put in, so you see that peekaboo of the the natural hue that um, with with the dyed color. Yeah. So the oh, I'm so sorry. Yeah, not everybody knows that. Mm -hmm. Like with uh, yeah, there's not a, a line of purple turquoise out there. Um, yeah, most of them always have been dyed, uh, but it's Kingman, and it's still really you know it just really gives you that interest. Because, of course, we love because of gemstones, but at the same time, we want fashion, we want beautiful, we want, you know, things to go with it. So, um, and also, too, not every turquoise is made the same. So, um, the turquoise that I use, too, of course, is the, the top, top quality. And with the process of how we actually do the color, it's, um, it is a permanent. Yeah, it's actually permanent. <gasps> this is my favorite part. So, we bezel set the stone and... We've then also pronged, pronged it. So that, that is some skill right there uh, for my artisans to do. So it, like you're getting massively like, yeah, double dipping here, uh, which is just so beautiful. The gram weight of this, I don't even know what it is, but it's like crazy good, crazy good amount of silver. I never like to skimp on pieces because, um, you know, I want them to last you forever. I want them to be your heirloom pieces. So, oh yes, citrine. So this is the golden citrine, and then I use the amethyst uh, to bring out the really beautiful bronze colors um, in this. And just so you know, the Kingman turquoise like this, how it's done too, it's, this is actually pressed, so they've taken material for this to happen, taken a lot of different colors, so you'll get that really cool different coloring. And then what they've done, it's almost like, in a way, kind of almost like they do to casting. They literally heat this bronze up and then the bronze fills in the spaces. So when they go to cut stones, there's a lot that we can't use because there could be like holes in them or whatever. So it's, it's kind of like, I love anything where they do stuff and it's like art because it's really hard to get like stones that are completely natural untouched. 
Um, they do, you know, a lot of students have to go through a heat treatment no matter what. Um, okay. It was 27 grams, Janelle. 27, C. Mm -hmm. That's a bracelet weight right there I for know, you. Right? But I love these little earrings. And I know we talk about doing other colors in these, and I've not yet done that. But isn't that sweet? How that just kind of ties in just something a little more, because it's a very like bold statement piece. And then this kind of softens them up a little bit. So I just, I love the matching earrings with it. And if you don't want to go that look and you want to go a little bit more contemporary, you can mix in something like this and then go with just our solid pieces too. Man, the quality of this is exceptional. Mm -hmm. See, and sometimes you'll see even a little bit of the, the blue that, um, that comes out in them also. And we put all the product, the, of course, the debuts tonight, the new items are on uh, Jodo, right? For your Janelle one day only. Mm -hmm. But all the other product is uh, half off on the social page tonight. So 50% off. Oh, the, that's right. Yes, we did, a, we did yes. a really big thing. So we took 50% off everything. Mm -hmm. And then the, we have Jodos. So Jodos can be 50 or even less than 50 at times. Um, yeah, depending on where we're at with it. So if you're an earring gal, these are really cool because if you have any other earrings, these come off. So you can <laughs> add in some of your other items. Maybe you have some earrings um, that you don't like the post to and you want to thread them in. You could literally use anything that has something like this and thread, use these as like earring bags too. Um, so yeah, or oh gosh, if you had like a dangle, you could even add something to, to make even more mm -hmm. out of this. But I love these. It's almost like you get some really elongated, cool wires with those. Um, Katie Buka said that stone is drop dead gorgeous. I have the purple, mm -hmm. isn't it? And this is where I can do more purples because, like, I love mixing this with like my olive quartz sometimes because of the natural colors in it. So I'll bring kind of earthy tones into it sometimes, um, and just really get a different look out of it, which I just love. But yeah, you'd, you'd be surprised at how much this really looks beautiful. Look at the chatty too. So you can combine your faceted with your translucent too. And it's just beautiful. So I'm going straight to the bracelet. Because um, the chatty, this is a way for, really for you purple lovers, but people that love tans and nights, that love a little bit more personality. And I love that it's called chatty because there's so much to chat about in this stone. Like mm -hmm. how many colors like do you see as it gets moved around, right? From magentas to purples to berries to blackberries to that blue pop that's like that tanzanite color that comes out of it. Even hues of yellow, right? I love this bracelet too because you can play with this a little bit. This is a hand twisted cable that comes in and this is that granulation work. So literally that granulation work here is all done by hand. Every little bead, every wire is on laid into this frame. And I have this fitting a six to seven inch wrist. <clears throat> and look at that. Look how beautiful, yeah, look how fun so that is, good. right? But yeah, this has always been one of my favorite styles. But yeah, I don't have a lot of artisans that can actually do this. And when we make a cable this small, we really have to um, keep that solder too. But like I said, there's going to be, a, see how I just move that a little bit? You'll be able to play with that just a little bit and move those out a little bit. So you'll have kind of fun with the, the cable. Jeanette you know, Slater said one. her daughter um, ordered that gorgeous chatty bracelet and matching ring. <gasps> oh my gosh. Yeah. Okay. So she got the ring. Now this one, I believe, is an eight. So, um, Michelle, on the sizing on this one, this would be a style normally I would say size up on. But I think I did that for the you, ladies of rights. So, you take your actual size in this one this time, ladies, mm -hmm. okay? But this is that full, like, oh my gosh, one of my most beautiful. Matter of fact, that's copyrighted too. I just realized going through and organizing all my stuff. Um, so, yeah, very exciting. See how pretty? I love opaques and faceted together. So pretty, right? Yeah, it is. Mm -hmm. It's like, okay, so coordinating pieces. Um, of course, I always do coordinating pieces. Um, but there's two collections to choose from this time. And this is that new really cool ring style that I just did. You know how I just did that the watermark bracelet, ladies? How You know how the scallop goes? I did that kind of like this architecture to the rings too. 
to kind of just give it a little bit more bling, but you're getting that chatty. And any of you ladies that have any of the Imperial Purple from me, this will all match back, the chatty with the Imperial Purple. <gasps> Look at the massive. Uh, yeah, this is this is a great fitting ring. I already know that because of what I, see, isn't that cool? Just that little bit of architecture, like just to make it just a little bit different, right? I've got, oh, that's a hammered one. I've got a new hammer. Did you see the new hammer bracelet, ladies? Oh my gosh. Anyway, I'm going to be showing that on another <laughs> tray too. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm gonna, I think my cough has gotten worse. Okay. So because I'm loving this and I'm going to bring this up, you can see that all of these look just absolutely beautiful with this look. And especially if you go with this necklace, this is one of our core findings now that we, we literally carry, um, is that necklace. So these are all the beaded stretch bracelets. Now I know, I believe all of these have multiple sizes in them too, I think. So um, ladies, I'm starting to do a lot of different um, adding sizes as we go. So keep checking. If we don't have your size, it might be coming. Um, and this one is BDS 376. Um, this one, I, I say animal print, but look at this is, this is such an art piece. So this is a really beautiful celestial quartz that they hand painted. Isn't that so cool? I love that. Mm -hmm. So pretty. It's just a little bit of a sheen, a bling bling <coughs> bit, but just super neutral too. I'm You'll wearing that one right now. Oh, are you? Yep. Oh my gosh, Mickey, you love this one? Yep. BDS 384 and then, oh my gosh, the celestial gray basically with rainbow. So yeah, this is going to go back with so many of the mystics that I do and stuff, right? Mm -hmm. And that one is BDS380. We always put these in the social page so you can see them. But as you can see, I literally uh, have the necklace that I did that matches all of these. So every single one of these uh, will go with the necklace that I'm just about ready to show. Okay, so what is the length on this, Michelle? Because I love it. And look at the clasp. This is a new clasp I designed for you. And it's so easy. Look at it, it's magnetic. See, there's a magnet. So it's gonna help you just guide that right in. Boom. It's gonna, but it's really pretty if you wanna like show the clasp too when you're wearing it, or you can put it towards the back. Um, but this is that gorgeous length. And I'm gonna put this on for you. Um, um, I'm gonna kind of add some of this other stuff and kind of show you some of the pieces when um, before I switch to my next tray. That's a 28 inch necklace. 28. Yeah, it's a nice little thing. Mm -hmm. And look at that cross. This is my signature cross that I've had. And yes, I am going to be working on the gemstone rings to match these because that is something I designed before. And so we're working on that. But yeah, I, I always want like a really just like wow piece cross. And I think this really does it. It does. Talkative topaz. So we've got the talkative topaz here. We have the chatty quartz in the middle. These three points are amethyst. And then, did I put a pink, pink tourmaline? tourmaline? I know, I keep sneaking those pink tourmaline. I know, in. I love it. <laughs> I just, well, I love tourmaline, the mm -hmm. fact that I, that I found those. So actually, I'm gonna slide that on right now. But, um, and then I'm gonna keep showing you the other pieces that will go with stuff. That way, oh, actually, I can slide this one right over my head. Okay, so the other uh, pieces of chatty, I did two earrings. So I'm gonna do the little French wire, or you're, you've got the hammered. That just would go with just about everything, right? So same gemstone, I just did two different offerings. So you'll be able to have the really long skinny one or the little lever back, right? That opens up. And very close in height, right? That one's probably a quarter inch shorter right here these so this one looks like about an inch and a half and the other one's probably an inch and a quarter total and then if you just wanted something a little bit more classic right so I love going kind of you know contemporary like just really fun on a bracelet but then I want something a little bit more subtle maybe you do these then right so this has the watermark and of course the bar hinge and again, mix them with your blues. Uh, the blue quartz, can you imagine like doing this ring 
and then maybe on this finger mixing in the blue cord uh, the blue quartz that I have because you see that pop of that blue that tanzanite blue oh, quartz yeah. ooh the opal I have that opal that flashes all these colors too yeah there's probably so many things ladies right when you go to get ready you're like oh, this matches with this this matches with that mm -hmm. okay so the yes. next tray is kind of a pink and kind of a purple hue um, but I'm going to step out here and kind of show you some of the different pieces so with this necklace um, just to kind of kind of give you an idea so you know if you were kind of mixing these around a little bit or maybe you wanted to put on your beaded on one wrist like this so you could flop your like tip to tip bracelet into the oh what about this one what if you just flop this one the tip to tip with the beads right mm, that looks good. Mm -hmm. or you could and then you keep just your basic like bracelet with that on that hand but that kind of gives you some options of looks um or maybe you want to mix in the um the kingman turquoise the mojave kingman turquoise and make it more of a bold look you know but just remember you've always got your silver necklace too um, if you don't want to go with a beaded look and that will kind of bring everything back in too Kind of for the look mm -hmm. and had a question okay. for you. Yes. Right yes now. questions. Yes. Is a non-magnetic enhancer veil called a fixed veil? What do you call is there a term for it? We I know we usually just say a veil. We just say bales. Yeah, right. the bales. But I wasn't sure. Mm -hmm. was, okay. Yeah. I wasn't sure if there was an actual term for that. So we're yeah and then we call the other ones a magnet um, enhancer veil. That way you can like open it and we're tending to do more of our things with with that but i like to do as my old smaller bales with some of the the chains because not everybody wants a chain like this or beads they like just a light necklace and that's why i have my new beginnings too mixing in if you want a lighter neck because you're always going to go like more bold on the earrings or something else oh speaking of earrings like if you did this oh i gotta put these on because mm -hmm. i think pretty. this will be a nice mm -hmm. really pretty look um, but just if you want to go with a dangle like this or you want to go like I said with something shorter just for color too I'll put on one of those other earrings um, so you can kind of get an idea so if you want to go with something like that or more dramatic longer that will give you kind of some options of what's your look okay so, oh, I'm going to bring my little stack rings into this because I forgot to show these. So, actually, it kind of goes with my whole look over here anyway. So, um, I'll let you have a sneaky peek of that real quick. And then I will take off the jewelry that I have on and then get ready to show you some of those other ones. You know what? Some of those bracelets actually would be pretty with this, too. And can we repeat? Actually, I really love this one with some of those too. Uh, Peggy was asking about the beaded necklace. So Peggy, that is BDS 417. Oh, I never showed it. Yes. Oh, okay. okay. I never showed the tag. I love it. See, keep, oh, I don't have a tag on this one, Michelle. Okay, oops. Uh-oh. Oh, drop it in the feed. 417. Oh yeah, so sorry. I actually don't have a tag, but um, mm -hmm. yeah, you can see we, we bead on silk um, thread and we knot in between the sections. So it is definitely a very, very nice constructed necklace. Like it's, when you feel the quality, it's not gonna be like some of the, the ones. Um, like I said, we've really rounded down to just a few beaters that really do the best of the best. And that's what we're, we're moving forward with. Cause I, I don't want just a great deal. I want, I gotta have the quality for you. I just, I have to put that quality in. And some of the other beading, they were leaving spaces and some of that. So um, we only went and, and upgraded the, the, the beads. That's why we kind of did a bead blowout to go, okay, this is our standard. This is where we're going to stay. And speaking of that, uh, B10 for any yeah. bead purchasers gets uh, them a discount on their bead purchase of $100 <coughs> or more. And we're also telling all the people who buy beads okay. during this promotion and they're going to go into the spinner for a special gift. So you want to make sure that you get your bead purchase in. Any bead purchase will get you in the drawing. This is my classic little bracelet. I always want to start with this because if you've not got a bracelet yet, I always say start with something like this. So this is some of the most difficult to do that open filigree work that's domed like this. 
So this is in my line, one of my core findings again too, that I just love to use. And see, look how contemporary that is. Um, so reversible, sometimes you might wanna wear it like this or you wanna wear it like this, but this is the bracelets where so many of the ladies get the doubles and that's their look. So they wear one like this, one like this. But it's super easy, magnet enhancer. So it's a retention. So it's you're gonna have two safeties on that to keep that um, on your wrist. And so I'm gonna flip this one on because it's really pretty, of course, right? With our uh, this show only bracelet too. Um, and look at the beautiful, uh, the granulation work. I love the sets like this. Ladies, I gotta tell you, I priced this one just to bring it in singly again because we had it. Uh, we can't because it's so much just to bring one in, it just does not make sense. Um, so having a set like this, I'd suggest, trust me, you're gonna love just the one or the two, okay? But give one as a gift, okay? Maybe start this in your little gift closet. Um, but these are really fun because you can really stack up and make your looks even bigger. So like even with this, like if you have a regular band ring like this, these are really fun because you can stack up and make a bigger look. Isn't that pretty? With a lot of my other band rings. But these have all the little granulation filigree work that's in it. I just, and this is a full eternity. These are really hard to do. Ah, surprise! <coughs> and one of them says courage, right? So it, maybe you even keep it like this. And I love that, the courage to face the day. This is the seren in the serenity prayer, which is, really been a cornerstone for me um yeah when i when i start feeling i just say you know i just I, I say that a lot that was my first prayer that i got to learn um and then of course now it's i go to god for everything <laughs> but before i just had to have something that i could go to quickly so um yeah this set always one of my favorites i just absolutely love it but when i can do it in a, a, a deal like that that's where you think of, you know, thinking about giving one as a gift. I gotta be honest, like I like them all, like I keep them all, but you know, if you're pinched for a gift, sometimes it's, it's a nice one to give for sure. Okay. The Tree of Life bangle, mm -hmm. we have three sizes. Oh, thank you, Michelle. We have a six and a half fitting a five, seven, five to a six, seven, five wrist. We have a seven and a quarter fitting a six and a half to a seven and a half. And we have an eight, just a couple, that will fit a 725 to an 825. So that eight is getting low. I'm gonna go straight into our Lavender Moon Quartz because this is a luxury stone that like, um, whenever I can get my hands on the material, we cut all throughout the year to actually find that material that we can actually have enough to finally cut and um, make a collection out of it. So I like doing the bracelets that make it where almost everybody can get into them. So I'm always gonna do those adjustable bracelets. So both of these are gonna be adjustable. So I just toured this one, I'm gonna put it on. But yeah. Michelle, maybe you can go over both bracelets. Okay, so the one you're putting on is gonna fit a five and a half to a seven and a half inch wrist. And the other one will fit a five, seven, five to an eight. Oh, I just love this. I just love this piece. And, um, yeah, this is the one I also did in the Rose de France too because I found enough. And to me, this, it's just such a pretty little bracelet. So pretty on. Oh, it actually would go with the, uh, the purple that I just did too. Yeah, so this one's actually gonna fit more, um, you're gonna have more give to that too. Where this one goes just to a seven and a half. But look how pretty our little uh, bracelet is too. Like, see how pretty those will combine together? So if you wanna wear it more for contemporary, so pretty with that. Mm -hmm. And I really wanted to, when I did this uh, larger size like statement ring, um, I still kept it pretty low profile, but this one um, is not does not open as a bypass. This one I have done um, to close. And this one, um, I did say you go up a size. See, so I'm usually an eight, do you see where, Definitely with the way that I did the gallery, you will be able to like half size, whole size up um, in this piece. The nine is actually my favorite. The lavender moon, which makes it, it's just this dreamy, dreamy material, hard to find where you see it's just like you get lost. But 
It is such a neutral stone. It's almost like a blush lipstick. It just goes with so many things. It's all, it's such a neutral. You, Question, if you could show that with the chatty so they can see the difference or compare it to the chatty. There we go. Thank you. Yeah. Absolutely can wear them together. So pretty together, right? Especially if you brought in that other, like, like for sure, say if you had your chatty, like, you know, doing this kind of thing. Mm -hmm. With, let me grab it, one of those rings. What did I do with it? Or am I still wearing it? No. <laughs> Where is it? There we go. Right? See? And then bring in that. I mean, how pretty is that crossover right there? Right? Love it. <coughs> I can tell my uh, coughing is going to be out of hand tonight. Okay. So, here we go. Um, oh, actually, I think I want to keep those on. Because that way you can kind of see the difference between the rings. So this is C, where my, this is my seven. See how much more comfortable that is on my seven. This one, true to size, okay? So this one, look how sweet that is. With the, the little filigree, the little fringe of panty. This is one of my favorite little bands. It just, it's so good. So that way you can kind of see the scale and the difference in size. But both like hard press because they're both so comfortable. This is done so well on the inside, ladies, that it, it wears like this one. It, it feels like it's this size. Yeah, I just, ooh, so pretty. Okay, earrings. I just love these earrings. Like, even, yeah, these earrings are everything. And don't you love how it's like a blue kind of hue to it? You know, there's blue moon quartz too, and lavender moon quartz. Because there's almost like a lavender to it, but it's so neutral. It almost wears like a moonstone, right? Because it has that adrolicence. Oh, oops, can't say that very well today, can I? <laughs> adrolicence. Yes. Okay, so you're going to have those little earrings, which I would suggest with both. Um, but, man, I love these little all silver earrings, though, because it matches back to that little bracelet. Isn't that cute? I love these earrings. It's like these were always one of my favorites. So pretty. <gasps> oh, and, the, and that new little bracelet too, bringing in the high polish. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Oh gosh. I like that with it. You know what? I love this right here. Oh my gosh, I have to put that back on. <gasps> oh, see, I love the tip to tips. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh my gosh, I love that together. Oh my gosh, that's definitely a fitted look too. Mm -hmm. You know, sometimes you want to go fit it. Sometimes you want, you know, things a little bit looser. Look how pretty that, right? So neutral, right? I mean, think about what you're wearing. Like, this is such a, you know, neutral color. You could stick it with so many different colors, right? You could go in the blues. You could go the pinks. You could go the purples. Yeah, very much. Ooh, I love mixing them with my Black Knight, too. Your grays and stuff, too. And your blacks. So pretty, too. Of course, I know I will always mix those in. Okay, so the earrings and then my favorite because this is actually all movable. Every piece. Isn't that so cool? It's a, in the shape of a cross. And ooh, I'm definitely going to put that on my neck because that one is so pretty on the, uh, oh, yeah. the station chain that I have. Oh my gosh. Matter of fact, we're going to be getting more in because we hardly have any of those left. Um, but look at, I'm going to put those bracelets on too, because look how, see how it just brightens it up so pretty. Mm -hmm. What do I do with the white? I'm probably wearing it. Oh, I put it back here. Okay. So ladies that want to get even just a little bit more. We're having requests for more blue moon quartz as well. I know we have not gathered enough. I'm trying like the amount, like I can't even do a ring yet, ladies. <laughs> um, so <laughs> might put another year. <laughs> so yeah, it's super hard to get this kind of material. So, um, but trust me, uh, yes, yes, yes. I will be doing that for you. Okay. So let's go into the pinks because the pink vapor is just as easy. <gasps> oh my gosh. In the coon site, right too. So pretty the coon site is with this too. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Right. 
And the kunzite is BDS 394 and 395 are the two kunzite beads. See, I see I have to do the right stack. Like look at this, okay? So this is where I would do this and probably put this here. And this is how I'd kind of stack. Like, yep, right there. Pulling in the filigree with the beautiful filigree here. That kind of still going back, a little bit more color pop. Or if you're doing maybe the blues for the day, throw in the blues or the Amazonites or something like that. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, you could easily go into the Amazonite colors, right? If you took the pink out and you wanted to pull more of the blue out of it, like you could do this instead of this, you know, pulling those out. Okay, so Kunsite, let's go into the Kunsite beads because I, I wanna tell you, these are the biggest beads we have. They're 12 millimeter and they're amazing. So I took everything that they put, they had, um, cut it up and I just made them into stretch bracelets because they're just too, too good. So, um, and that one is, and do you know, ladies, we just canceled the coon site. So I told you I was going to get more for holiday. It's, it, I rejected I, literally out of the 200 stones, there was only 20 I could use. So unfortunately the coon site, I don't have any more coming for a while. I know. Well, we're going to keep trying that 20. We'll cut 500 more stones and that could like, yeah, we're going to still try. So, um, pink vapor, and this isn't a star cut. See, see that beautiful star that's in the middle of that. And then of course the British T-Rose. I, I put the British T-Rose topaz with it, didn't I? Am I correct? That is English T-Rose. Oh, Br English. Sorry. Missed it. Topaz. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. British is topaz. Um, and English. No, English is topaz, British is quartz. Thank you. But again, if you really want to pull the pinks out, that totally works also mm -hmm. too, right? But these stones really do play back to each other. So if you decided to go with the pink vapor, but you went with, they are, look how pretty they still are together, right? To pull more of that lavender mm -hmm. out. So these just look beautiful, beautiful together. And there's two sizes in that and, bracelet. And the pink vapor? Yeah. Oh, we have two sizes. Okay, go for it. Uh, limited on the larger size, but uh, we have a six and a half, fitting a six to seven interest. And we have just a couple left on the 725, which will fit a 675 to a 775. And you see this dreaminess that to that stone and that the faceted, but ladies, this Definitely, I mean, Lavender Moon, you're missing out. It's, it's one of those really high-end stones like Crazy Light. And um, yeah, usually it's totally untouchable, but again, when I'm able to go in and get the rough that I need for it, um, and then we cut, we cut until we have enough. Okay, this is my look. So you know I'm always gonna wear a statement ring like this, right? So this is always gonna be my look right there. Yep, there you go. So you pull in the tree of life with the tree of life and then just that. This is gonna be, oh man, this one fits so good. Whenever you see that kind of gallery like this, it gives you that breathability. See, and it's not going to move around. See how it just sticks, stays up on your hand. I like that. Okay, love it. Okay, so we showed this, we showed these guys. So we got the pink, ooh, look at, I actually kind of think this would be pretty over here too. Mm -hmm. Let me see, I'd probably do this and then do this. Yeah, pretty, right? Yeah, probably would stick one of those little beads in there. Okay, and then the Kunzite, Kunzite necklace. necklace. Yeah, yes. That is BDS two two eight. It is twenty two inches with a one and a half inch extender. Kunzite, black tourmaline. This is the mother of pearl, cut in a honeycomb. And again, you see the silk that's knotted in between all the beads here. 
and this is a beautiful um beautiful piece now this, these are at uh, eight millimeters so with the enhancer bail you'll end up sticking the bead in between like this okay or you wear it just on its own okay so i will kind of show what that's going to look like i'll put the next little tray under so you can have a sneaky peek and then i'm going to try this necklace so you can kind of see what that's going to look like on um because some of these are so pretty oh you know what i'm going to switch this over here and i'm going to put this one on here because i think with this one i'm going to make it longer oh by the way it's got the bali clasp too so it's got the watermark bali clasp which we're starting to switch everything to but now we can't keep up making them all <laughs> so these are always pretty to stick something underneath and then let's see I'm gonna make this shorter oh that one I'd have to take that other one off um, while you're doing that, can I ask you a couple of questions? Yes, ask me questions, questions as I come out like this. This would be a perfect time, perfect. Michelle. So okay. Mark was wondering if you're going to be making any more malachite rings, <gasps> any new malachite rings coming. Um, the malachite I have is going to be way better. I love the cutting on the other one, but the patterning and stuff, it's a smaller stone and we're really struggling getting that really awesome pattern. So yes, there's gonna be one more towards Christmas, but I'm gonna tell you the Malachite I have right now, I'll never match that because I literally hand selected, only kept a few of the stones. So um, it's gonna be pretty. I did this really fancy cutting and stuff to it, so it's gonna be different, but it's not going to get, have that same cabochon feel is the one that we just showed in the pear shape. And Kat, yeah. uh, Tom, was asking about toe rings. <coughs> you thought about doing toe rings. Oh yeah, well uh, some of our middies actually do fit on toes, mm -hmm. but we do have some coming, a set that has the space between it so you can open them up more. So um, I don't know where that's at. I think because we were refining the QA because it should have been here already. But I think we were changing because that one we did multiple sizes in the sets. I think we did like a two, a three, a four, so that you could mix it up. And um, I think I, I wanted to refine the edges a little bit more so they were softer. So I think I delayed it, okay. make, trying to make it even better. So, <laughs> Which okay. everybody said, Janelle, they're good. And I'm just like, oh, I think we can. Well, I didn't realize, like, sorry, ladies. It's going to take another three months. <laughs> Marisol. Marisol said, Tanzanite studs. Thank you, Janelle. Getting them. <gasps> and just yesterday got a new Tanzanite pendant. Oh, so my gosh. So she's excited about those Tanzanite okay. studs. Okay. Did you release the Tanzanite last night? No. Today. Oh, today? Yeah. Okay, good. Oh, well, I'm so glad. We did. Everything we okay. released at noon today. The microfaceted, this is, I told you, the last of the last of the last that we have today, the Tanzanite. It is gone. So... There's going to be a couple bracelets. We don't have it because, again, I I refined it and changed it since it was the last. So the bracelet's going to be like a month behind. Um, but, oh my gosh, the ring is everything. And the studs are everything on that raw material. Mm -hmm. And we did have a question. Barbara is mm -hmm. holding off on finalizing her order. Yeah. I know we're not on the Tansy trade yet, but can you tell us if the new rings are true to size or not? So she yes. Place her order. This one is true to size. Sorry. That ring I, I fixed for you, it is true to size. It, by your normal Bali size. Okay. Yeah, don't go up in that one. Good question. Um, yeah, I'm trying to get those fixed as I go because you just need to be able to buy your size. Because if I see something and it says size up, I'm like, what? how much do I size up? So I am I know what the eight should be if you're used to buying my eights. And I, that's what I'm kind of doing accordingly. And because we, we don't want to, we just want to know our size right. and always buy it. Yeah. So I'm working on it. And then Amberly said to share with you, she picked up the faceted Tansy collection. Oh my yes. gosh. <laughs> it's so cute. Did. Oh my gosh. I, yes. <laughs> well, because she bought all the cross collections that I did in the Tanzanite too. The fact that we're getting some uh, faceted Tanzanite and said, but that raw, 
like material, like, oh, that's what I want. But I microfaceted it even more. Uh, but oh, I just, I need more of it. I need more. Okay. So what was I doing? Okay. Yes. I was just kind of showing kind of the, the different pinks, what you could do. Maybe I should put on one of those beaded bracelets too, just to kind of give you an idea of some of the pieces. Um, but I wanted to do that cross. So that means I'm going to have to take this one off because I want to show you how pretty that cross is. Um, I have it and it's, it just, it's, just so elegant. I'm getting super sweaty. It's probably gonna stick to me. Mm -hmm. um, this is during, with it's all warm. these lights. I they've got lights. I know it's oh my gosh, isn't that so pretty yeah, though, pretty. Oh, isn't it? Nice. But I do, I tend to like, I do, like throughout the day. But it's just, and it's just that super pretty neutral color. Like for the summer, we're starting to get like a little tan, even though we're supposed to put sunblock on. We still, at least, this is probably the only time of year where it's like, okay, you know, mm. I'll wear some more V-necks to, to kind of open up. Otherwise, I like my turtlenecks. <laughs> yes, I like them as close as I can. Okay, let's go to the tray because Amazonite, late days, did you see the deal? Boop, boop. Those are the two that we have, and I know we went extreme on it, um, Michelle, didn't we? We did. Because the pendant, we just got new stock in. So it is last call on that. Um, on that one um, and then hopefully um, if I can cut enough stone up we can do a reorder that can come in next year and the pendant we priced at $79.99 for today only mm -hmm. and the earrings are $69.99 oh my gosh and those earrings are like the, the earrings are everything you know why because look at it's a full piece of Amazonite Oh my gosh. And it's that really, really like saturated color that I've been trying to get my hands on more of. And uh, I just love the bead too. I just love. And ladies, believe it or not, the weight is pretty good on these. So I'm kind of excited. Um, they're not gonna be too much, um, but just really beautiful on. Oh, for sure, I'll, I'll have to, I'll, I'll change into those when I come back out. Um, but. This is where I get to show my bracelet. Okay, you know what? This one is the fitted, but I gotta be honest, I think, Michelle, I'm gonna trade it back in for this one because I need a high polish hammered um, with my other stacks. So I'm gonna give the small one back, okay? So you're gonna have to adjust me because I want this one to go with more of my stacker bangles. So you can see, you might overlap into multiple sizes, ladies, okay? Mm -hmm. So we have three Three's, sizes. I three sizes. It. Okay. We have a six two five. Ladies, the really petite, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm a six inch wrist. So that one is super fitted on me. And we have it fitting a five and a half to a six and a half. We have the six seven five fitting That's a six one. to a seven inch wrist. Yeah, I like that. And then we have the seven and a quarter fitting a six and a half to a seven and a half inch wrist. Now I do have to say though, you know why? Because see, I like this and See, look at, I love this with the contemporary. Mm -hmm. Love this, like more of the filigree with the contemporary. And then see with this one, oh yes. Did you see the gallery that I did on this? Yeah, you think that might've been hard for my artisans? I know they were like, could we just put in, no. I have to have that breathability and my little signature Janelle Adair in there for you. See, kisses. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of kisses in there for you. And that bracelet you have on um, our new release price, right? Your Jodo, well, $99.99. Oh my gosh, wow. right? I know, I'm so excited. But something really contemporary to, um, you know, uh, yeah, this is like. And I've been requested to repeat the sizes and fits. Of those, the new bracelet. The new three bracelets. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna slide bracelet. this one on next because this is our luxury <laughs> bracelet that we have um, the one size that we brought in, because to me, it's perfect for this fitted bread. Like, I'm gonna love the texture look. So after you get done with that, can you go yep, into the I'll size? Go into that one. Yep. Look at this. So the, the new Black. tip to tip, Don't. we have a six and a quarter, fitting a five and a half to a six and a half inch wrist. We have a six, seven, five, that will fit a six to a seven inch wrist. We have a seven and a quarter, fitting a six and a half to a seven and a half inch wrist. 
And then the new, the one you're putting on there is the doing life together. I know, I love that and part. And that will fit a five and a half to a six and a half inch wrist. I'm well, still sad this one isn't larger. I know. Well, <laughs> and that's the thing is we, um, we definitely, but, oh, see? Oh, this is like. That's good. So ladies that have the, this, these two are going to be your perfect bracelet. Like if you have a small wrist, oh, isn't that good together? Oh, you need Anna's knife though. Like, yeah, you need a little color. Like, oh yeah, look at that. Okay, sorry, did I interrupt the sizes? Okay. On the silver, no. I just did. love this. But I haven't done the hands and I Okay, because I did, uh, this is a, a lot of adjustability. It's gonna start at like a six. Mm -hmm. to oh, a actually seven. maybe five, yep. seven, five. We have a six to a seven, seven, five. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Let me see if this, if I can't get this one. And Amberly's trying to clarify which one. Is, so you had the smallest one on originally on that bracelet, right? And then you said yes. you wanted. So you had the. This is the five. small Amberly. No, the three sizes. Yeah, this one is the okay. smallest. Okay. And then Amberly, because I have my stacker ones, this is the other one. That's the six. So I wanted to use this as a bangle, but you've been getting fitted lately, Amberly. So this might work. Like, you know, see? Yeah, she'll probably like the other one. I think but I want, I want mine to, to go with my, my other bangles because I want something really smooth and contemporary to go with like my ones like this, see? Okay. And it lines up with this one. And I wear this one all the time. Oh, see, I love that. Mm -hmm, that looks really good. Ooh, it feels really good too. Okay. <laughs> We, re we got a few in. Only I'm so sorry, ladies, that we didn't get more. You know we ran out of this. We've got, so I, I won't show it a long time because I know probably you've already found it. So, yes, it's the gorgeous Amazonite. So, there was 10 that we brought in. That's it. So, I don't know what we have left, but it almost filled almost every size. Mm -hmm. But it's very quick because I know you had some pieces to fill in, right? But I am working on some more Amazonite. Um, probably in about two months, I'm gonna bring some square back in, okay? To go with these. Look at the little shiny, I, oh, the Amazonite. And look at, oh my gosh, the Bully Breeze. Mm -hmm. Like, it's so good with the Caribbean quartz. I love it with the Caribbean. But I love Amazonite with Caribbean. But look at how fun all of these are. Well, and I wanted to bring this back in because I think with the texture of this, the little beads, I, you know, we have this little set that is just so fabulous. But I thought with that little contemporary and then bringing in the high polish, this little double set for your thumb, and it is such a great price, right? Thirty nine ninety nine. I mean, it's we keep it at that all the time. But these are full. Like I told you, I upgraded these. So see, this is a full ring now. Look at that. Raised jawline beads, but super polished down so they're smooth. Flat jawline beads set in between the frame. Ah, best, best of the best granulation work there. But yeah, isn't that, it's kind of fun how it like plays mm -hmm. off. I kind of thought, mm-hmm. Okay, uh oh, did I not do my thumb ring? I love the spinner as a thumb ring. So don't forget, um, you ladies that want your fidget ring, we've got it back in. Uh, this one is my favorite as a pinky or a thumb ring. I think oh, I, what size did you give me? Uh, do you I think it's seven? seven. I think you gave me a I six. Think it, Oh, maybe my old eyes thought it was an eight oh, yeah. on the label. <laughs> That's a possibility, right? Yeah. Sometimes it's hard to, I don't know if I have my readers on. That's so funny. Okay, <laughs> love, but yeah, so that way you get some nice little silver options. Oh, I did want to bring these in because ladies, um, always going to give you an air. Look at the shape of this. Do you see the... This is really a cool shape right there. This is a big hoop look, super, like I couldn't get any more lightweight. 
but I still wanted to do the Janela Dare beadwork on it for you. But I love these. These are the ones that I have. Look at the inside. We even did it on the inside. And still managed to keep them just really lightweight. I love these because literally I put them in and they actually, I, I put them into my ear a little bit further. So it looks like they're like water flying, falling out. But I love the, the back design on it. See, it's a little like it graduates back up again. But always affordable, really lightweight, just one of those grab and go kind of, you know, earrings to have in your purse when you forget earrings. <gasps> We've not brought these out. I and I have to be you. honest because of the coral collection, I wanted to bring the dig in deeper because look at, they hammered in the high polish. Mm -hmm. And these are the sexiest, coolest, like just, they just really dress up whatever you're doing. Or if you've got a casual look, you put them on, you just look really chic. One of my favorites and super, like so comfortable on too. I love those earrings. Me too. But the coral, um, oh, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm going to stick them back on the coral uh, tray too. That and way, just, you know, really, when I show the coral. I just realized the Janela Dare and Hammer's, <coughs> Hammered Spinner Ring yeah. is on uh, Jodo for $59.99. I, I guess that it Oh, oh my Jodo. gosh, this is? The Spinner Ring, yeah. Maybe because oh, we got geez, more Oh, that's, geez, that's super upgraded. Oh, yeah. that's really good. Did you see the gallery in this one too? Yeah, this one is amped up really good yeah i love the silver basics you just okay where are you there you are okay this is the 10 millimeter size and in the celestial snow is of course the one that's going to go with just about everything it's going to just bling up any look that you have so these are really great little basics but i love the eight millimeter i tend to wear the eight but i know you ladies are loving the bigger beads too um so this one is BDS 375. We, and this one is BDS 398. We have multiple sizes in all of these, okay? But that way you can kind of see the difference mm -hmm. on. So you want to go for the bigger look like this. But see, for me, I just, I love this, this length, this, this size to me. It just is just really classic, really pretty. That looks good too. And then, yeah, if you wanted to see the different, I wanted to bring this one out because this is the different color of the Amazonite. This is that different material. Remember that marquee that I brought in with the Amazonite? That's what you get on this one, okay? So this one is BDS 403. So it's a little bit different, but it mixes. If you have the original one, it's pretty. Like this is super neutral, so it tends to really kind of tie back to a lot of things. Um, and then I think I've showed you, oh wait, did I showed, oh, I never showed you the pendant. I'm so sorry. Okay. Yes. It is so pretty. And think about your little filigree bracelet too. Oh, yeah. you know, see, look at, you get the flat jaw one pieces and you get, this is such a pretty bracelet with it. Right. Um, but love this this and this is a, more of a medallion size. Yeah, it's a it's a really nice size, but most of all Gorgeous gorgeous Amazonite, which it's a, its own little person. It's not Sleeping Beauty. It's not Mexican turquoise color It's not Kingman turquoise color. It has its own just gorgeous coloring to it <sighs> I love the back And then can we get on the uh, Janelle Adair hoops. Can we get a measurement, please, Janelle? Oh, yeah. When you get a chance. So I wanted to show you the difference on these two. So if you want smaller, though, these, uh, yeah, are these your little go-to, like, Goldilocks all day, all day? Yes, we love this size, right? We collect always gemstones in those, right? Mm -hmm. Wanted to do that. So inch and a quarter. Yeah, and so lightweight. That's why I love these. These I kind of made for myself because I like to just put them on and forget about them. And then now, with those though, I would totally, they come with our little sort of backs, but remember you always have to adjust them, right? So you have to pinch them in and self-adjust. Mm -mm. 
ladies spend the money so I didn't have to add thirty dollars to the earring get a pair of our backs because trust me these will like if you have thinner ears or like larger piercings this is going to make it look like you've got a nice taut really great little ear again it's almost like you went in for a little facelift on your ear like it mm -hmm. really holds it up great and why that's the difference too see it's double see double supportive okay and with the self adjusting but it also has to do with that thickness too right and I had to add a little bit of size too whoopsie where'd you go okay so I added just a little bit more coverage on the back of your ear too than my other ones. I cannot get to this quality in Indonesia. Um, with the silicone and everything else, I make these here in the US, so the quality is like exceptional, okay? And because I wanted to do the best, so I always did those oversized, you still get them, they're sterling silver, but these are all sterling silver too, but there's it's a silicone, so it's self-adjusting, okay? And the reason I picked this one is so the silicone never touches your skin either if you have latex like allergies so yeah this is the route you want to go right there so you can pair it up get even more support when you triangulate it like that right so you can imagine that behind your ear going yeah it's going to sit it up just perfectly i keep these at that same price all the time um and it wouldn't be because if I had to ship them over to Indonesia, package them, put them, it, it, they'd be unaffordable. So that's why these, we sell those separately, get one or two pairs, and then just use them with all your earrings. But truly, they're going to be the best. You will never have to self-adjust them. They self-adjust on their own. And this rem this reminds me of Teresa Jory, this mm -hmm. one. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I yeah. just... Yeah. Like, BDS 322, it is a 32 inch with a one and a half inch extender. Amazonite, Hubie Turquoise, I believe. Um, Michelle can correct mm -hmm. me if yeah. I'm wrong. Uh, uh, Freshwater Culture mm -hmm. Pearls. This is turquoise and magnesite, same way the other purple turquoise is done where they crush it and then compact it back together, okay? And then I just had some really old huge, huge pearls that I've been sitting on. I think I had them in my uh, collection for like 20 years. I can't even get big ones like this anymore. They're just cool. Just, yeah, irregular, big, big pearls. You see like each one's gonna be a different size, but they're big. Yeah, and what's the length on this? That it's just a such a good necklace. 32 inch with a one and a half inch extender. Love that. Okay, I'm going to put the next tray under and then I'm going to try a couple of these And then things. Teresa asked, um, apparently she missed the ring on your thumb. Is it the stacker set? Is that oh, yes. Right? Teresa, that's that one. It's always at a good low price because it, you get the jawline beads. You get this. And this is the one that are fully finished. I upgraded the bands. So this, remember I used to have something similar on a stack system? I made these real like upgraded bands now but i love them for my th i love it as a thumb ring but look how cool it is right with the little boop 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 mm -hmm. i think it's just like adds a little texture so cool and then she was also asking if we have any sunstone or carnelian in the future oh yes and I sunstone is coming sooner than later carnelian is coming sooner than later because we are almost out of carnelian and they see a little bead in some sort of oh no no i made the beads in the carnelian however <laughs> the carnelian beads are not translucent but it's it was impossible but i got a cool carnelian color but no when i went to price out the beads ladies the the necklace would not be affordable ever like and he would not do the coloring so i'd have to have all these random colors um. and like i think the necklace it, it, it was not a good one. Not a good one. Yeah. No, I saw the that and the peridot that's coming. Oh my gosh, so peridot, pretty. the stones. It's so, so pretty. pretty. No, you know what? I said, I'm done. <coughs> peridot has been kind of just so heavily included. Smaller sizes, they're so expensive for the bigger one. 
I went a bigger one, ladies. I don't know if you're gonna, like, there's a huge price point difference between the 9.7 to 8.10, but I'm doing it anyway because I'm putting it in some really beautiful styles, some basics we need, mm -hmm. and I, like, it's expensive. It's gonna be expensive, but I want the bigger pieces of Peridot. It's gonna be pretty. And I have a couple okay. questions. Okay, so the blues, yep, ask me questions and I'll... Oh, oh, I want to try these on. If there's any more emeralds in the, in the future. Yeah, I hope so. I hope so, because um, not up to par for you yet. So we've... Uh, I've designed a bunch of collections and we're looking for other options and some stuff, um, but I am trying on the emerald because his price went up so high on the emerald. Mm. So that's small, the, the size, I, when I cut it and set it into the design, I don't like it. So, but I, I'm not giving up Audrey. Um, I will, I'm, I'm a designer, I will get it there for you. <laughs> but the stones, they kind of cooperate, cooperate with me. Okay. And Brandy asks right. if so English good. and British tea rose are the same color, just different stones. Same color. Yes, but, different but it, it tells us that's a topaz, that's a quartz, right. so they don't Just ever get mixed up. That. Okay. So that's why it's named differently. It is the same color. However, they can't do the British tea rose for us anymore. Oh. That means the English tea rose, mm -hmm. they're going to end up. Yeah, interesting because we didn't do an order because I always try to keep as much cut up for my accents. So what do you think? Are these earrings okay on me? You guys be honest. I like them a lot because oh, yeah. to me, I like I like a, I like my earrings to move like that. If I'm gonna wear them, I like them to be kind of and movement. like they're wearable for the weight. And usually, like some, I'm like, ooh, those are too heavy. These, um, yeah, are really nice. But I love that the stone you can see the color like all the way. Like if I move from mm -hmm. the back, ooh, don't look at my bald spots. Today I was struggling <laughs> with my hair. <laughs> I doubt there's one. I'm kidding. Okay, but that's going to be the, the, the we got to go to the, the, the coral. We're ready for the coral. Okay, oh, did I show that bracelet? I already did. Okay, man, that's a good one. But this, oh. Uh, Kathy Bardell is so glad that you got the red. It's her favorite color and she got it all. <gasps> oh, speaking the of. The coral? Yes, Oh my gosh, Kathy, I love it. Um, getting it all. This is one of the ones that we're gonna, mm -hmm. if they order a collection, you're gonna you're gonna uh, match up the pieces as oh, tomorrow. No, tomorrow, we're yeah. doing it tomorrow. So yes. the coral really does come in different, it's really hard to keep the patterns and the color and the stuff like that. Only when we launch a debut, we wait, we put everybody's order together, the ones that get set, Please buy it as a set so we can make sure we're matching the pieces, okay? But if you have multiple orders, we always go back and look. But the girls, my girls said, please, if you are one that wants matchy-matchy, please put them on the same order because it's easier for them. Um, because, like, I try to be there when I launch certain things, but if I make them so nervous when I'm not there helping them <laughs> match. They're like, if they're going to be mad, you know. So please put it together on the same order if you can. But tomorrow, we already know people were shopping early. So you like rushing to get your size because it's going to sell out fast. So I get that. Tomorrow, I'm going down. I'm going to do it with them. And my girls are great. They just want, they're people pleasers. They're so codependently awesome to make sure everybody's so happy. That's why. They're just amazing. Their hearts, they just want you to be happy with. But... The patterning and stuff is almost impossible to get exactly matchy-matchy because -matchy. I'm wanting patterns in it and me and Cadet go back and forth. She's like, we can't get patterns all the time. I know that, Cadet, but that's why you're there helping me. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, um, gosh, I have to go to the ring because the ring is just like the silver, uh, the amount of silver in this ring, ladies, it's beyond. Look at the work on it. Mm -hmm. It is like, oh, I feel like it's like, I know it, it's, it's, and the sizing, 
So, Michelle, you gave me an eight, right? I did, and it, yep, true to size. I right? true size this because I want you to get your real size. But, oh, comfy. Okay, this is going to, I'm going to have a lot of you ladies coming back for more bigger rings like this. Like, this is that same comfort as the turquoise. Like, this is that same. But I look at that. See, it's that same beautiful, beautiful fit that I do. Ooh. I cannot wait till you get it home. Okay, and I it is had to do this. $89.99 on the ring. Oh my gosh, seriously. And or the pendant. Oh my gosh, when you get it home, you're gonna be so happy. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's, okay. Well, and I kind of anticipated it was so funny because they did ask me, you know, the pricing on this. I said, well, no, we'll, we'll end up selling it and then we'll, we'll get a reorder. So I said, we're gonna do it really crazy. See, look at, See where the little flowers are just all on laid onto it. The cable, we're doing a lot of really cool cabling this year. Oh, look at the red hat ladies. Like, oh, I gotta bring that purple back in. What do I do with it? Red hats, look at that. You can put those together. Yeah. Red hat society. <laughs> okay, so, oh, I just love this for you. Oh my gosh, it's so good. I'm so excited. Okay, so yes, we will be matching all these up. Make sure that, try to get the patterning, the color, because the colors, you know what I do with it? It's see, you get a you get a blue red and an orange red. That's why everybody loves the coral that I do because whether you're warm or a cool tone, it works, right? It's like we're in search of finding that perfect red. Look at that. Look at that, even on that side. So cute. Okay, did some earrings. And the earrings are $79.99. Oh, that's silly. That These are so hard to find two matching pairs. No, that could be why Kadek was complaining. Um, <laughs> yeah, those were, because I have to have her help, and then it's like, no, I don't like those. Those are harder to do in Skype, to, let me tell you. Okay, love this too. You know, when I was saying just a really contemporary cool, love that. That's where the digging deeper earrings. Mm -hmm. Two sizes, ladies. We yes. have a six and a half that'll fit a five, seven, five to a six wow. point five. And then we have a oh seven, two, five that'll fit a six, seven, five to a seven and a half. Okay. $139.99 on the bracelet. Super Amazing. Fun. Super fun. You know what? This is where I still do kind of think, you know what? I like to put something in between. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Wow, look at that. that yeah, really pretty. pretty. This is the bigger one, but I do have a smaller one, right? Yeah. See, I prefer the small one, but you ladies that like the bigger, that's go for it. Yes, very, very pretty. Um, so, watermark edges. Oh, this would be so good next to your loved one. Another bracelet, too. Oh, oh yes. your really new contemporary one that I did. Oh, my gosh. So pretty, right? This, like, definitely deserves a beautiful stack, though, right? It does. It's like, you know, this is where you could just frame in a really beautiful, like, this is where you wear your twos together, too. Like, Look how classic that is, right? Just clean classic. Yeah, that'd be really, really pretty too. See where the, the size is just like spot on too? So the small one or the bigger one, I have both of the bracelets really pair up and line up with this really good ladies if you've got those. Kathy just said, I guess I better order the red beads because <laughs> she ordered the set. Oh, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah, it's like they're kind of, yeah, they're kind of fun, right? A little bead into it. Um, but, yeah, kick back. You're going to have that really beautiful. You're going to have your little fringe of panties, of course. So pretty. And, of course, this really beautiful, like, custom cut stone. Okay. So I, I, I do love those together. Is, okay. Oh, we have a question, Becky. Is, that, is the red honeycomb bracelet a quartz? This is mother of pearl. Okay. They actually uh, dyed the mother of pearl. So it's mother of pearl. Yep, they just took the, the mother of pearl. 
Um, look how pretty that is too though, mm -hmm. right? Uh-oh, I'm gonna have to put those on together. Oh, I better show this bracelet. Cause you know what? I keep, it looks good with everything, doesn't it? Oh, it has been looking good all night. So, um, the price on this though, like ladies, like this is my upper couture style. This is definitely a luxury bracelet. So do you see the styling on that? And we the have press button, but it's a retention, see? With the press button. And we have two sizes. We have a six, seven, five that will fit a five and a half to a six, seven, five inch wrist. And we have a seven and a half fitting a six, seven, five to a seven and a half, one twenty nine ninety nine for today only. But we have two sizes on this too. I forgot. On that one? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So this is the Chrysacola Sonora and I'm, I love this whole, but, but you know what? The Amazonite that I just showed too, I gotta be honest, I, I love it with the Amazonite too. Like mm -hmm. really the, the blues and the green tones really are so pretty too. And the two sizes in this one is a six, seven, sorry, a six and a half that will fit a five and a half to a six and a half inch wrist. And then we have a size seven fitting a six to a seven and a quarter. But I was thinking about like just mixing, like, oh, I love this bracelet. Okay, I gotta show this bracelet again, hand woven. <clears throat> These are all hand turned. This, the, oh my gosh, the work on this bracelet. See, we slid, soldered those. This is a lot of work, this little bracelet. It is just amazing though. So all green onyx. And do you see the fancy cut? This is that same kind of lotus cut. See where they cab the top? It's not a table facet because I, I literally cabbed it. Table facet would be flat. I wanted to give that dome that really glow from the side of it. But man, this is a great little mm -hmm. And there's, with the cabling, there's some adjustability. So not here, but here. Like you want to bring it in, see where I just molded it in there. You want to make it smaller, you can. You want to open it up more. These areas will flex a little bit. So this one's, these two sizes I did in this is going to fit just about everybody. Okay. <gasps> Look at this. So we have a size six and a half fitting a six to seven inch wrist. Love it. And then we have a seven and a oh, quarter. Yeah. Reasonable. And that's going to fit a six and a half to a seven and a half inch wrist. I do. Okay. I got to bring in something contemporary. Oh my gosh. Again. Right? I love how these just kind of just perfectly fit in between your wrists like that. I love the colors, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. T. Victoria was asking, is the green coral? And it is not, it is on No, this, this one, uh, no, this is tiger's eye. These are tiger's eye. Oh, the this. Green bracelet, yeah. Green onyx. Sorry, green <laughs> onyx. Yes. <laughs> tiger's eye. Yeah, this has the, uh, but look how, yeah, you can add in mm -hmm. the greens to this too. And the tiger's eye, we have two, we have BDS 434 and 433. Two sizes, eight millimeter or 10 millimeter. I tend to go with the eights, but you ladies are loving the tens. Boy, do we sell a lot of the tens. You love them. Okay. Oh my gosh. Look how pretty, like, look at, like you could split some of this up, but right. I just, this, um, I just love everything about this ring. Actually, I need to get one for my girlfriend. Hey, would you pull me a seven on this? I got to send her this. Um, she just had her birthday. And I missed last night because I was doing all the, the coding on all the, the copyrights. So I'm like, oh my gosh. Because I worked till like super late last night. So I, that's my no matter what meeting usually. But yep, I had uh, like had to get it done. So the Chrysacola Sonora bangle. I think <gasps> uh, T. Victoria was asking about the green in that. I wish I had the buckle bracelet because the buckle with this is so cool. Oh, the so, Chrysacola Sonora. Yeah, so it's part of the, uh, this would be, so Chrysacola 
has a lot of different minerals that are in the chrysocolla. Uh, malachite, uh, gel silica, um, cuprate. Um, there's other things that make up a chrysocolla. So if you go in and say chrysocolla, it will tell you all the different the minerals different. that uh -huh. cause the different colorings and stuff to it. Um, yeah, Chrysocolla Sonora is coming out of one area though with this. It looks like the Sonora Sunset. So that this particular material, oh, please tell me where, oh my gosh, mm, nope, it's all gone. So <laughs> it's, no, it's I, like, I don't know. the more I stress about it, the more like, so I, Nikki, is that something we do put on the website? The origin? Oh, uh, the origin? Yeah. Origin, yeah. Not typically, no. Oh, we don't? Oh, we need to be doing that. We can probably... Oh, yeah. Oh, gosh. It. Because we do that on the... Spec. We have all that information. We the do. The fact that we it's do. not getting to the website. Ooh, no, 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 no. Okay, we got to work on that. Okay, that's on your list, Mickey. <laughs> Patricia Hayes is wondering, is the red coral bracelet a high polish and hammered? What was the red that? coral. The red coral. Oh, oh sorry. What was the motif? So it is um, high polish hammered with a little edge of watermark. But then we snuck in some frangipanis. Mm -hmm. Because so frangipanis need water. So like I tend to use those motifs and designs a lot together. <laughs> and then I the know. green beaded necklace. Oh, you're just getting to that. Okay, perfect. We had a request to see the green beaded necklace. Oh, okay. So that this is malachite. And this is the onyx, the green onyx the little leaves, the leaf bale. So just something really bright and basic. Um, now this one, I believe I did adventuring green jade malachite. Can you, can you verify that? Verified. Oh, okay. I did that. Okay. Um, <laughs> and that is a Cause trench. I can't always remember what I, when I do the designs, like it takes what? <laughs> Three months just to get the necklace Right, that. by the yeah. time it comes in. I know. I'm like, and then uh, that's a 22 inch with a 2 inch extender BDS 124. I'll try this one on two ladies, um, you know, once I uh, break down. Because look at, that's pretty with the emerald too, right? Mm -hmm. But the Chrysocolla Sonora is like, man, turquoises. Um, I, I just, I know we're going to be out of this by the time I get my Hayward Muse. But ladies, the Hayward Muse with this is so pretty. It's a faceted, and it's this burgundy. It just sets everything off so beautiful. Look at that. Look how great that is, right? Okay, so let me take the green off, and then... And they're all really excited about the origin of the stone being on the website. Yeah, mm -hmm. because, yeah, I, it's like, I, I do that with all my stones. But I used to remember everything, and I did. Just like my poor little collection names. As I was going through, I'm like, oh my gosh. I started crying because I was like all the different journeys that I've had and the fact that, but that's okay. All I have to do is pick up God's word and he puts it back in. I, this is so far my favorite trait, my favorite look. Like, mm -hmm. I just love this. Okay. So get, I've already shown everything. So get, get off this. Okay. <laughs> so anyway, so the, um, oh, but I'll, I will try. I'm going to sneaky peek this one. Oh, ladies, this is almost gone. This bracelet. Oh my gosh, you loved it. But anyway, this this is almost gone. Um, I can't do a ton of, this this just took way too long. Literally every little bead, every and just the finishing on this just to make sure it's smooth, you know? It, it's just too much work. But I love to bring in a few of these a year. And um it was supposed to come in holiday, but that's how long it took. That's why you're just getting it six months later. It's a little late, but I think perfect for the occasion, right? The summer. Okay. I, I think it's it's gorgeous. But um, I'm gonna try it on the beaded. Before you necklace. move on to, can we see the green onyx ring on your finger, please? Oh, I didn't I didn't show the green. Yes. They're keeping you on track here. Yeah. So I'm gonna do that. Oh, I kind of feel like I want to wear the red one now. Well, look how edgy it looks with the black top. Like, it's like, ooh, oh, and the emerald. I never showed the emerald either. Okay, I, I kind of felt like I was doing something wrong. Okay, so. 
I was like, well, because I, I was like stylizing my wrists and stuff, not like going, hello, Janelle, look at the collar. Yeah. Oh, that looks good together. And see, I love this. I love this and this together. Oh my gosh. But you know what I always do? This is the one where I, I actually size the emerald to this finger. So I actually wear a seven and I wear it right there because I think it's just so cool. Yeah, I wear those, those two together. They're loving how the green onyx ring is glowing. Oh yeah, the green is just, yeah, this was just fun. Yeah, I went back in and um, yeah, it's just really great little cut, right? Yeah. I hope it was. It's dreamy, cloudy, but then you get the translucent from the side, so it almost looks like, oh, you can't see through in the way that it's cut because it's so thick. Ladies, this stone is like, it's big. It's, it's super, super high. So I could get that faceting, that fancy faceting on the side, but that's where you get that, that little bit of that, that glow. When this is out in the sunlight, ladies, amazing, amazing. But you can kind of see it, how it plays with the, mm -hmm. yeah, it, it, it's pretty cool. But I, um, I had one stone cutter. He struggled to get these all uh, calibrated. So I don't know if he'll take an order on that again. Well, I hope everyone is checking out the socials page because I was looking at some of the prices as you're doing this and they're crazy low. $74 for that ring. That's amazing. The, oh, on some of them, <laughs> yeah, right? because of the half price. Hey, yes. I think this is pretty too. Like if, you know, if oh. you're mixing the greens and the reds with the malachites, mm -hmm. they get, especially if you do the chrysocolla, mm -hmm. I would, yeah, I, I would totally in. throw the coral in there. Mm -hmm. That looks really good. Yeah. See, I love like doing the color, but keeping it neutral. Like that's why sometimes I used to have so many blacks so that it, it's just easy. To, I, I just picked my jewelry out. Okay. So we're going to go under and oh, you're already starting to see the tanzanite, right? Oh, I'm okay. Sure. That yes. is it ladies. Like seriously, nothing, nothing, nothing is going to be coming. So, um, I, I'm like, just call in, just, Find this. Teresa it thought I was going to keep it on the last tray because she wanted to see it, but we didn't, Teresa. Oh. <laughs> we didn't make the wait till the end. I know. I'm like, right? Okay, so let me take this here. Oh, I love this. Oh, the emerald. Did I show the... I did show the inside. Mm -hmm. Okay. I think I did do that. Okay, I'm taking all this jewelry off while you're, like, taking a little sneak peek over there. And just want to remind everyone, bead 10 for 10% yeah. off any bead Don't purchase of $100 or more. And they go into a drawing for a Janelle selected special surprise gift. You guys, do you see? I always try to get some with the, see the sparkle, the chatoyant, and then you get some transparent and some like opaque. At this, I love this raw material because can you imagine being in that pool of that gorgeous tanzanite? The fact that I can get it into this size I cannot wait. All the, the collections that I did with all of this, someday you're gonna be, and true to size. So I size this up to you, or see, oh my gosh, it fits just beautifully. And one nineteen ninety nine. It can go on my seven too, and still fits beautiful because look what I did on the inside. It is Mac daddied out for you. How much? One nineteen ninety nine. Okay. Yeah, I did the most, like, domed it for a just as gorgeous, gorgeous micro -faceting. But isn't that the little style so pretty too though, right? Mm -hmm. I love See? that. Isn't he cute? But this is my saddle. See, it's slightly bowed up so that you get that really beautiful uh, breathability still too. Look at the micro -facet. look at it. You know, I just can't believe this is all we can work like. I've never felt so discouraged with gemstones, like literally how much is not coming around. The fact that I did earrings, ladies, yes, they're going to be pricey. I would probably do those at the Jodo price because if you look at what they have to go back up to, mm -hmm. yeah. but this is the last of the material that I can do. Even trying to get matched pairs was like nearly impossible, but so I wanted to do some cute little, you know, studs look at it's gonna like people are gonna see that color from the side look at that and those are 149.99 so pretty for the jodo price for today <coughs> so the bracelet that is going to be coming 
I think in about a month, I did a six and a half and a seven in a cable. The seven will fit up to a seven and a quarter and the six and a half will fit up to a five and a half inch wrist. So if you're a five and a half inch wrist to seven and a quarter, those are the only bracelets because I ran out of stones, okay, to be able to do the other ones. The and pen. again, no more tanzanite. Pendant is one twenty nine ninety nine. I had to do something really like since it's tanzanite, something really artsy, very. And I think we have a new viewer, Margie Shirley. She was asking how she can see the shows and when you're going to be on um, social media showing your jewelry. So every Tuesday and Friday, we do um, here. We're on Facebook, Sardis Social. Or and, YouTube. Or YouTube. And um, that's at 3 o'clock. And then every, on the other days, we do some little pop-ins, too. This bracelet, you don't need anything. I love because you can, you've can. you got some adjustability on this. But this one, oh, whoops, did I just do that again? This one is just awesome, awesomeness. And that will fit a 6 to 7 inch wrist for $249.99. Right. Ooh. Okay. So I'm going to put the Tanzanite on this hand. I've got to go straight to the, I love this ring and true to size. Okay. Because so I size this up appropriately too. So you take your true to size. So pretty. $89.99 on the ring. So this is all Prezio light and I do fancy, fancy cuts. So do you see that this is that really beautiful new, look how pretty it is with Tanzanite though. So pretty. Um, this is so pretty with blue moon to, I mean, lavender moon too. Like anytime you take these neutrals together, you know, maybe you have a print top that has these dreamy, like just high end colors like that. Oops. It's a quartz, so it's going to hold up to throwing it around. <laughs> okay. So why everybody needs this ring in their oh. life. This Do you see the, that this is the bird's nest cutting? The fact that there's over 300 facets and it holds its color of praseolite. Look at it. It's just a piece of art. Every little leaf is cut and bezeled around that gemstone. And it is a this show only <gasps> special price, $59.99. Ladies, it's everything. But this is the kind of ring too, where I, would, I told you I really, what did I do with those stackers? Oh, that was over here. This is where you get sometimes stack sets. So ladies, you want a bigger look, go for it, okay? This ring, I couldn't get prettier in it anyway. But take your two little stack systems and make a bigger look. Look at that, look how pretty oh, that is. Pretty. But that's what I'd love to do. You know, because it's just, it is just such an elegant, like, piece of art. And this stone, trust me on the Prezio lights anymore, that price, like, you'd be, I don't think you could buy a custom cut this many facets, competition cuts, Prezio light at that price. Yeah. Maybe a regular faceted, not calibrated, they're selling just the size, single piece, but... Not this kind of stone. Oh, this. Oh, I put the courage one on. And we have sizes. But see, you put the courage down below because we need to see courage, right? <laughs> we have sizes six through twelve in the crazy light ring. I love this. So, ladies, I hope you're getting this one because it is one of my ones that I will carry. It's a standalone piece because it goes back with so many things that I've had. I've had other parts of the collection. But I just continue to bring the ring back over and over because it, it just looks it just looks great with everything. Praise your light with tanzanites. Praise your light with any of your green onyxes, any of your greens. Praise your light with any of the semi-precious because literally you see it. It used to be called green amethyst. It's so regal. It got its own prestige name of praise your light. That's how special this find was when they found the praise your light. So... Definitely need some of that in your, your gem wardrobe. Okay, so I'm going to take this off because we know that is a showcase piece by itself, right? Yes, amazing. And this ring and this pendant is what I did for the collection to match. So see, 
I love this. Do you see how many layers I did? of overlapping the silver work with this. It's so beautiful. And the pendant is $99.99. See, I don't do flat jewelry. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and this one, appropriate. We had to let just a little bit of light in there. Because the faceting, like I needed that light to keep reflecting back. Wow, look at the cuts on that. That's my special, uh, my, the honeycomb, because nobody does honeycomb cutting. Like they charge like crazy amounts. Not, not when you look at a mine. Yes, I, I just, I love elite stones for you. Okay, now here's a, a standalone that we, we uh, have this left also. Do you see the star on the top? That's so pretty. Is it, isn't this just like, yeah, this was something that, um, We'd never be able to, like, we took this really, really amazing rough that we had. And per, not going to do a reorder on this, but I, because I don't think we could ever match it again. We went a little too good. So, again, a piece. This is just that really amazing, see, it's, it's that bale that's into the back. You ladies were asking for more, especially Amberly. Yeah, she's the style. Here. Mm -hmm. Yes, she loves it. So yes, sometimes quicker, sometimes slower that I can get things. Okay, this one reminds me of Brandy, always. Because she, she was one of the first ones that started like collecting the pre-night, right? And many, many, many more of you ladies out there too. But Brandy literally helps you shop all the pre-night and the price you want and the rainforest jasper. Those happen to be like three stones she calls out a lot. Again, another fancy custom cut stone. Do you see? These are these are all made cut to order, so I even draw the stones out. What I love about Rainforest Jaspers, every once in a while you're gonna find a little part of that agate in it where it's kind of translucent. See? Every once in a while you'll get a little piece where you can see where it's, and I love how it ruffles. You're gonna see this really beautiful patterning inside of the Rainforest Jasper, and that's from Australia. And the pre night, no, never gonna be, you can't cut or make an order for pre night. You just have to find it already cut in the market. And this one, Janelle, if you're wanting it, we're down to just a couple left on that, but we do have it priced down a little bit more than half. I Two, did. $249.99. Yeah, I priced this one down because all of these stones are expensive, expensive, expensive. I mean, it is. So I today, thank you for seeing that on my note because I'm like, I know some ladies were eyeing these two pieces that are left. And I'm like, I know you want to do probably as a set. So I'm trying to bring it as affordable as I can. But you have to remember the Praiseo lights really, I mean, the pre nights really vary in color. So you're going to get this like sometimes hue like this, but they're all those dreamy kind of, uh, that's what I get in the pre-nights, but sometimes it can go more on the green shade. But this is the variance. You, you, you will not get exact, exact with the pre-night. It's impossible. And the bracelet's going to fit a size six to a seven, seven, five wrist. But see, it's beautiful. See, because I pull in stones that will still be complementary, right? Do you see? Where it's, it's, I still bring them in the other stones so that it will still combine together perfectly. Okay, so I went into the pre night. See, I went straight for this uh, <laughs> tanzanite. No, I did not forget about the other tanzanite. Are you kidding? Okay, oh my gosh. I love this bracelet. I love this bracelet. Did you see these little pieces? I, I love quilting, you know that. So you know I did the quilting on the stones. So I wanted to bring some quilting back into the silver. And some of my favorite boots that I wear all the time have the quilting on them, and I just always feel really special when I wear those pieces. So this is to balance out the wrist and to give you that uh, coverage so that that tanzanite stays up on the top too. So it's for beautiful design. Did you see this? Is that so sweet? Oh, it's a great bracelet. did I, is, isn't I, we've got like, I gotta tell you, I, this bracelet 
It's so pretty. Mm -hmm. And the Tanzanite. Did you see the Tanzanites? <laughs> and so affordable. So yes, affordable. We have it. Ladies, I it's this is ridiculously affordable. $144. It's a one forty five, basically one forty four ninety nine, fitting a five seven five to a seven and a half inch wrist. It's a must have. Mm -hmm. Look at the little baby I did. I had to because ladies, you love some of the smaller sizes. I just love this. So just just something really really beautiful. And this will be ninety nine ninety nine for the pendant or the ring. Look at that. Look at the gallery on that. Is that just like amazing? Of course, Magneta can answer. Did it look at, do you, you know how pretty this is on your ear, ladies? It is so, this is so pretty on. And the earrings are $129.99. See those little pieces and they're so cute. Look at the color, right? <laughs> Yeah, the clarity and stuff on the some of this. Yeah, they're all drooling. Oh, <laughs> so good. Okay, again, I had to bring my really really cool contemporary. Look at that. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's so good. True to size. See, it, not too matchy. Okay, right. Mm -hmm. I originally did the ring in this shade, and then I was like, no, I want that really beautiful. See that up build? And this is gonna go with that bracelet that you, you got for me, right? With the shaping. So, yep, maybe this one with the other silver one. How, how classic, how beautiful was that gonna be? Okay, you wanna make it a little fun now. So, okay, I'm going classy, classy. This is my evening out. Now I'm gonna go um, and I wanna make things fun. So this is where you bring your owls in because I love the flow, like it's, it's so beautiful with Tanzanite still, right? So maybe, you know, like you wear this on the other wrist, you wear your little owl. See, look look how beautiful it is with the Tanzanite, see? And the owl is going to fit gorgeous? a 575 to a 775 wrist. Yeah, this is a really great fitting. Uh, this is really great fitting. So mixing. This is, yeah, this is gonna accommodate and fit a lot. And over here, which one? I kind of feel like, you know, I love that over here. I love this here. And then you make it really just fun, fun. Look at the carving. The fact that you're getting that lab adorescence on this, like, is phenomenal. But look at the detail. All hand bezel set around there. Oh, look at that. This is such a great little piece. But really, really comfortable. And just, what a fun personality, right? Yeah. Look at that. See, this is where you can do, like, a tip to tip here. Then you pull in a bead. Um, one of those beads like this, maybe, you know, for some color, you know, mm -hmm. something like that. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to think, is there another, oh, wait, oh, geez. Oh, look at this one. Ooh, okay. This might be more me. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. I like that one. Yeah, mm -hmm. love that. That's that. This is the Celestial Multi. So what is that one? Is it the rainbow? The ra yeah. Celestial Rainbow. Rainbow, yeah. Uh -huh, agate. Quartz, agate. They use the same kind of thing. They're seven, hardness is a seven. Super durable. Okay, and then of course you can bring in your little pendant. And I had to bring in that. Good so thing. Anne Marie Pelham does that critter corner. So I'm sure she'll have, if she hasn't already, have the owls on your critter corner. Oh, I love it. Anne Marie. 
Oh, mm. by the way, she received her um, matching ring to her yellow pendant that we sent her. Oh, yay! She said it fit great. She loves it. Oh, and my gosh. Thank you, thank you. Oh, I love it. Congratulations. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to snick the blue because I want to go with a little bit brighter, brighter color. And with the summer, the Caribbean quartz, I'm telling you. Yep. We have a request to see the Tanzanite earrings on, please. Oh, sure, sure. The little stud. Absolutely. Ooh, I'm going to get our my backs, though. Yeah. I'm going. They, they come with uh, some backs that have the sterling silver and the silicone. But these, mm-hmm. Because they dome out, I want it to just be like. These are the ones like Beth, when she's wearing the ones this size, I'm mm. like, those are so good. Mm. But I love how they're microfaceted and they're domed out. So I'll kind of move my head too so you can see that. Did I just get that one? One ear I can feel more, sometimes the other ear I can't feel <laughs> sometimes. Okay. They look so good. So they should, are they sparkling? Kind of, the microfaceting should pick up light. We can try and zoom in on you. Let's see. Don't move. Oh, oh there oh, we go. Oh. oh, yeah. And then just move your hair just a little bit on one side. Are you zooming? Oh, see, look yeah, at we zoom Tanya's here. here. She knows the video. Okay. Oh, that's even better then. There. Oh, yeah. Okay. Nice. Yeah. Okay. Right. Yeah, studs there. like this, you don't feel them. But you definitely want that supported back on them. But if you've already got another secret one, but ladies, if you, like you've tried some, they're okay. These are going to be really good. The, the bats, you will love them. It's something I was kept looking for, but I couldn't get there with Bali, so. Okay. What do we got? Okay, wait a minute. Remember, we had a promotion on these earrings. So we have been flying out on these. So I wanted to present because I love these colors together. Um, but... This is a new debut. I've got to actually show that right away, Michelle. Like, let's go over this bracelet in this collection. Hold on. I went to the other one. Let me go back. All right. Look at the colors. So pretty. So it, this is the Cockatoo Days, and we have it fitting a 5.75 to a 7.5 inch wrist. Look at this. 5.75? Oh, oh, okay. I thought it was 7.5. I'm like, this fits me because I made it for me. <laughs> because I've, I've been dying for this bracelet. So anyway, um, and I wanted it in different stones. Look at that. Oh my gosh, right? That's really pretty. But this is my luxury oval chain that is so good. Oh, these end caps are so great. Fully adjustable, ladies bar hinge so that it just and remember this this continues to get softer and softer and softer so pretty okay so the cockatoo days um i love that it really showcases um more of the blues the way that we we cut it cockatoo days tends to go like more on the green shade but i love it how when it cut it really did this prism of pinks pastel lavenders um, light blues like it's just such a pretty pretty color it's gorgeous it's very soothing well and you know my ring this is my favorite ring mm -hmm. style like it is elevated it's just yeah this is like one of those really beautiful classic classic sets your little workhorse like great little size um, always the shoulders that go there um, but yeah, I would totally stick in a watermark, but this is where I always love my tree of life. Um, cuffs. Did you lose your bracelet? I know. I'm like, <laughs> I always have to have those. See? Because you put in, see, I love the filigree with the watermark. So you can kind of tie in on that. Yeah. See with the watermark still? Mm -hmm. Or you flip it over oh, for good. the flat jaw one too, because you already have the, and then you still get your, like, true wow. life, right? Yeah, that's a beautiful, beautiful uh, set. This Now, this was my first time. 
right? This is it, or is this? I, well, I just wrote debut. Second time. It's funny. I wrote debut with a question mark because I didn't think it was. I thought this was a second. Oh, maybe I, I, think I did. It is. Okay. I did. Is this yeah. the second time okay. I showed I'm it? I'm pretty sure. Okay, well then, because the fifty percent off. Yeah. That's yeah. why. Because it's it's like it was the same price as Jodo. That's why we were okay. I'm like, uh, so I did show it once. <laughs> oh my gosh. Because I was so excited today. I was just like. Yeah, it's just really beautiful, really classic. Um, love it. Now, you want a little bit brighter, you know. Oh, actually, you know what? I've, this is, actually, this is maybe where I would switch this one, though. With that one. That way you get that, you get that. I'd probably, I'd probably do it like this. And then move this one over to my other, well, which I do have on. Dorette, Dorsey River said your blue stones are out of this world. Oh, blues are just like, I, I always look for new shades of blue for you ladies so that we can literally hit every kind of blue. Because there's London blue topaz, blue topaz. Like with, with the quartzes, I really try to find and cut different angles on them so that they're pretty. So I am so glad you're happy about the colors. Okay, did anybody get this home? And I told you, it's so much more in person, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, this is like a 10 or something. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. But anyway, you can still see, even though it's two sizes too big for me, it's still wanting to fit. It is still <laughs> wanting to fit. <laughs> because I made a really good gallery. <laughs> Isn't that funny? Because it's yeah. like, you know how I say it, it always kind of grasps onto your finger. Oh, look at that. That, that's a prime example of how I make my rings good. Because it's literally two sizes too big. <laughs> that's funny. The um, bracelet, we did have a question is it on if we're getting this back in. in the Which one? Cut, the bracelet that matches this in the trillium cut. The twilight. I know we sold out of the bracelets really quick. Mm -hmm. um, we're almost out of pendants. So if too. we end up selling through this, it will come up, yeah. We have so much on uh, order, right? Um, but yeah, these, uh, I, I don't know how many pieces, it, it could be getting close, I don't know. Why don't you say? Well, I'll, I'll check with Jessica. Yeah, okay. yeah, like with that. Um, I, I tried to do a little bit of a bigger order on that one and then was gonna wait for a year, bring some other things. But it is, it is such a pretty collection. Amy Long said, yes, the stone is spectacular. She's not sure why she waited so long to try it. It's like, it's kind of one of those things because I take that opal material, right? It's created, yes, <clears throat> the bottom is created. Um, but I, I use the natural crystal quartz and I micro facet and I window box it. So I stick it over the top of it. So it literally draws the colors up. But this one is one of those ones that literally looks like you've got like a aquarium underneath. It's just so beautiful. However, the lights though don't show that there's a lot of green to it in this bright turquoise. So it, it's one of those stones, unfortunately, that's so much more in person. That's why I worry about bringing it back again because it's like literally you'd have to trust me to say, okay, I love, if you love the Caribbean, you're gonna love this because this one has the same kind of spectacular show. But I don't know. Like I I buy something because it got oh, and it is pretty, but it doesn't like the green. And I think the blue green together is what makes this stone so much more special. Oh, I love this. I love I think this is so pretty. This pendant, pendant. we're down to just a few left on the pendant. And uh I know the bracelet sold out super quick. Mm -hmm, I didn't did. I didn't bring in enough bracelets. But I, I brought in a ton of rings and a ton of earrings. A uh, good amount of pendants, but definitely always I'm never bringing enough bracelets in. But see it looks so beautiful with the Caribbean. Mm -hmm. Now this one, is this the one I said to go up a size or true? True. Yeah. Okay. Just want to make sure that I wasn't wearing a nine. Mm -mm. Okay. Yep, fits good. Okay, so now this is just that really, really, uh, 
I have a chain link set in the Caribbean, but these are probably the two stones that I would say, ladies, get out of your comfort zone. Try these two types of stone. This one is my number one of any blue stone and green stone I've ever done. It's number one. It's, it's can't always cut the stones. There's only certain times a year that I get the stones in after we cut, but it is one of the most popular quartzes that I do. And it's because it has this gorgeous blue in this aqua turquoise that comes through. So cobalt blue in this aqua green ice. And literally when you move this in the stone, you, it, it is, it's, it's just spectacular. Magnetic can answer, and of course, the weight on this one, this is a medallion. It is amazing. Look at, see, I, th these are two pieces. So we create one, then we make the other side. Do you know how hard that is to set that over the top? Because it's two pieces we put together. Look at, it's lined up perfectly. I always try to see where they seam it. It's so good. They did such a good job. It's really top, top, top quality. Oh, me and Michelle love these because um, <laughs> we both been. They're, they're low on one side and high on the other. So it's a high and low. It's like a double hoop. And I um, love the high polish. And I, I love a good huggy that hugs your ears like that. So yeah, we love this. This is our tree of life one. So really they, they sit about like not even quite three quarters of an inch. Yeah, I love the, the difference in them too, right? These are great little basics, just fabulous little basics. Okay, so you already saw the This Show Only bracelet. So I wanted to bring in a, another ring. You know how I brought in the bigger statement ring? I wanted to bring in one that kind of would, would go really beautiful with these. And the This Show Only bracelet is $129.99 and that is for today only. And don't oh, forget right. the little earrings too. Actually, if you got a lot of Caribbean quartz for me, I'd say these are probably one of the cutest little earrings to tie back with any of the Caribbeans that I did. So cute. Really, uh, really great little size. See, isn't that great? So cute. But yes, these are the two most underrated. Like you get, people get them home and go, oh my gosh, because they're bright, colors you think okay what can I put them with but you literally they match back to so much stuff it's crazy but did you get the tip to tip uh the nope. bracelet sizes because we're there now this is my signature bracelet so we have a six seven five fitting a six to seven inch wrist and we have a seven seven five fitting a seven to eight inch wrist wow well I love that well, you know what I'm thinking for tomorrow? Because do we have the other tray. I kind of think I want to save right. my tray. Okay. They're asking if you could show the This Show Only bracelet again, please. Oh, this, oh, absolutely. Ladies, I've got something that I want to show you tomorrow because it's my stuff. I kind of want to sh save my black and white tray for tomorrow because we're going to pop in. Okay. Um. So it's still on the social and, oh, wait. I have two debuts on there. Is that a problem? No. Okay. Because I have a silver debut and a, a white mother of pearl. So we put them on the social page. The only but uh, we're saving it for tomorrow to show you tomorrow. I was going to say the only problem is Teresa Dory Stevenson has been waiting to see the cuff. She's going to think. Oh, she did? Okay. Well, I will show the cuff. <laughs> She's going to be like, oh, no. No, no, no. And you we know. need to show that this show only is. <clears throat> okay. So my ring, my signature ring I wear all the time. Oh, whoops, which remember, we can't find the eight anywhere. I looked again today. I think I have it. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> oh, okay. So I keep saying, Michelle, you gotta give me my ring back. Okay. So um, I get, because I ended okay. up giving my personal one away. Okay, so this is that ring everybody loves, loves, loves. I created the bracelet. And I created it in two sizes. We have a six seven five fitting a six to seven inch wrist, and then we have a seven and a quarter fitting a seven to eight inch wrist. Two twenty nine ninety nine, and it's just amazing. Yes, yeah. ladies, it's yeah. everything. It is Look a wow. wow, wow. It is solid and oh so good, 
<laughs> so good. This is my size right here. That looks nice, Janelle. So this is where I probably move my... Sorry, can't get that on. But I always wear my ring here. And this one is, I was just looking, 69 grams for the cuff. Wow. Yeah. It's oh, so definitely on Jodo for sure, but I will show this more tomorrow with my other stuff too. But Teresa, we had to get that for you. And then we need to see the this show only bracelet as well. Okay, it's mine. Uh, this one. This is the Cherished Forever. And we have two sizes. We have a 675 that will fit a five and a half to a 675 wrist. And then we have a seven and a half fitting a six seven five to a seven and a half, and that's on the special for one twenty nine ninety nine. Retention, press button, and just like just one of those really really just beautiful pieces. So easy, so easy to wear, and just yeah, stand alone, stack them up, so beautiful, so pretty, right? and multiple sizes, which I just love. And then this little beaded necklace, you can see goes with so many of the different blues. So that one's BDS 201, but this one is the, now this is where I, Angel White, this is the blue uh, onyx. onyx. Oh, sorry. This is blue onyx? I have Angel White, blue it's quartz, like Sydney. blue agate, and mystic quartz. Blue agate, which is Kel Sydney. Okay. okay, that's why. So they called it blue, but you, you can see it's the Chalcedony. You can see the glow. So blue onyx sometimes is, uh, blue agate sometimes is really same terminology, Chalcedony. Oh, okay. Okay, and this one, what's the other one? I uh, love that color. Blue quartz, blue agate, and mystic quartz. And then This they, is the mystic right here, mm -hmm. yeah. So anyway, just a really great little length again, um, you know, layering with your pieces. And the bracelet, if you look for a little bit more roomy size, this one is going to fit um, roomier. So that is yes, something we, really great. We have that up to a nine inch wrist. Yeah, Six yeah. So this is nine. yeah one of those pieces that see like it's too big for me, but so pretty, right? And on the cherished forever bracelet, you know which size. Um, do you typically wear in that? Do you like the 675 or the 7.5? I like the 675. Okay. Yeah, I love the 675. And then we asked um, uh, Victoria T. Victoria Gilmore was actually mentioning the coasters earlier in the feed and asking about the coasters. And I see that you have them on your shelf right oh, there. Do to you have them? Can you show them real quick? <gasps> right. The coasters. And yes. Then, and there's the white, the white one is I, the one I think we have left. Oh, is it? Okay. So the coasters are really fun because that's all hand shell that they, they, uh, they crack down and then they stick onto this. So it's just wood. See, they put that over the natural shell over the wood. Okay. And then, yeah, they're just, and then that's all natural shell. Isn't that so cool? And they, they, put it down on the epoxy, they put something over it, then they polish the top of this. So just really cool, right? But that's real shell. And then to the left of you is the white one as well, if you can grab that one up there too. I so think the white one might be what we have left on the website. The white. On the shelf. Oh, the white shell one. Yes. Oh, I love this I one. I think that's the one we have left. This is the one that yes, I gave. That is the um, one we have left on the website. Yeah, this is the one that I gave away all the time. So see the colors of the shells? So pretty. Mm -hmm. And then the, and I don't know what this is called. There is some kind of a, yeah, shell of some sort, but I don't know what it is. So, yeah. Have a look. Mm -hmm. Really pretty. Really pretty. That's what it's called. Oh, that what it says on the side. Oh, oh, the, 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 these guys. Yeah, the, the brown ones would be mm -hmm. the abalone they used. Yeah. But yeah, just really fun. You know, like on a patio, you know, you always look for things like that. And then we have one more. Uh, uh, Patricia Hayes. I'm like redoing my display. I know. Again. Like, what is, hello? Sorry, did I, did I, oh, sorry, ladies. Patricia Hayes says she isn't able to watch tomorrow. Are you able to mm. flash the debut, the white debut? Oh my gosh, yes, of course. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, because it is gorgeous. Mm hmm. 
Okay, did you see the carvings on these flowers? Oh my gosh. We bezel set in, did our little magic. It is so good. Oh, true to size, so good. Look how that just, see, I do that little bit of that saddle so that it just sets up that breathability a little bit in your finger too. Look at that. Look at that. Gotta do something just really beautiful, soft, but contemporary at the same time. Okay, oh my gosh, the did you see the fancy white moonstone though? That right there. That's pretty. That's my signature cut. Remember on the blue quartz that I do for you? He said, you gotta be kidding me. You want it in white moonstone? Oh yeah, yeah we do. Look at that, look at the, look at that. Per Freshwater culture pearl. Fully finished, adjustability. And the bracelet. Oh, I love it with this, right? Oh yeah, it's pretty. The bracelet will fit a six to eight inch wrist for $199.99. We have the pendant $69.99. And the ring $69.99. Yeah, that's just a great little size pendant. And to me, mm, on a snake chain, bolly chain, right? Look at that. And there was a request for Tanya to try on the smallest size of the big silver cuff, which she just did, and it is too tight. No, yeah. no, no, no. On that Very one, no. On, oh, the small. Oh, it's, it's too tight. Oh yeah, you would go the next size. Mm -hmm. Do we have the next size? No. Somebody requested to see if the small size on it. She might be Very doing good. a little pop in for a, <laughs> uh, tomorrow. We'll have her try it on. Oops, what are we doing? Okay, that's okay, over here. Okay, perfect. That's what. Okay, we're so that's yeah, good. then we'll show the rest of that um, again tomorrow because, boy, do, did I like Mac Daddy the wrist up. Yeah, and so because those were debuts, I just want everyone to know yes. the prices tonight will, at, in the middle of the night, they'll revert back to the 40%, but when I get up in the morning, I'll put it back on okay. the Jodo. So, so the, pr the, the price on this, right. if you don't get it tonight, it will be a short window, but since oh. I'm showing it again tomorrow, yes, I will. Yeah, because yeah. yeah. I want to give more of a tour with mm -hmm. all the other colors I put it with because it's, it's my favorite tray. Like, I love the neutrals. I love the... The celestial gray moonstone, like I, like yeah, we don't have any coming in. He's not even like returning our emails about how much he's got to send me. Oh, no. That means there's none. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, so I'm very excited about that. Okay, so we will do a pop in. Um, any of you that can show up and hang out with us tomorrow, that I'm looking forward to it. And it's good to be back. All right. Blessings your way. Thank you so much, ladies. You're amazing.